In this particular program, I am going to show you given an input uppercase character, how to convert it into lowercase and if a lowercase character is given, how to convert it into uppercase. For any other character, it should not print the character on the screen. This program using the while loop is also going to show you how to use the continue statement in a C program. So the user is going to enter a series of characters or any other character. If he enters uppercase A, it should print as small a. If, it, if he enters lowercase say B, it should print as capital B. So as long as the input character is not equal to character 0, I am going to continue this process of converting the character or ignoring the character. So if the input character is capital A and between capital Z, what I am going to do here is I am going to add 32 to it because the difference between an uppercase character and a lowercase character equivalent character happens to be 32. So suppose the input character is A, the ASCII value of A is 65. 65 plus 32 happens to be 97 which is the ASCII value of small a. Now it is also possible that the character can be small z small a to small z so in that case what i am going to do here is i am going to if it is between small a to small z i need to subtract 32 so that i go back to the old uppercase equivalent character so let's say the character is capital a sorry it is small a so if small a if i what is the ascii value of small a it is 97 97 minus 32 is going to be 65 and if it is any other character I simply should be doing nothing I should not be printing that particular character so I'm just saying the continue statement and here what I'm doing here is I am going to print the input character entered by the user okay on the screen okay I'm going to do ch now one thing I have missed out here is I should be reading the input character somewhere. So here I am going to read the input character entered by the user. So user is going to enter the character here. I am going to read it character by character. So the user is going to enter a character. If it is uppercase A to Z, I am going to make it to lowercase. If it is lowercase A to Z, I am going to make it uppercase. Any other character I am going to ignore. But suppose the user enters 0, it's going to come out. So let's try to take a look at this particular program by entering certain sample data. Let's see if it compiles first and we have not made any syntax errors. Okay, here it is syntax error. So it should not, I should not be giving a space between here and here. Then there is line number 10, there is one more error. Percentage C, address of CH. I've forgotten to give the address. Now let's see if it runs. There may be some other errors, but let's give the compiler a little work to find out the errors. So it seems to have one more error at line number 11. So it's character again for some reason I have given a space between these two characters which is which the compiler does not like. So just run it here. So what I am going to do is I'm, it's asking me to enter a series of characters and zero to quit. So what I'll do is I'll enter the name Arjun. Okay. Just see how Arjun is converted. A R J U and N. and after Arjun what I'll do is I'll enter the numbers 1 2 and 3 okay 1 2 3 nothing should be printed and after 1 2 3 let me enter 0 so the output if this program is right is it should print a in lowercase r in uppercase j in lowercase u in uppercase and n in lowercase and 1 2 3 it should not print so here if you see it's done it right a is lowercase r is uppercase j is lowercase u is uppercase and n is lowercase whereas it has not printed 1 2 3 because of the continue statement so what this continue does is the minute the user enters anything other than capital a to z or small a to z it will hit this continue this continue becomes true because of this else continue means anything after the continue in the body of the loop does not get executed so this printf will not get executed straight away will go back to this condition here so the minute you enter any other character it will encounter continue and the control or the jump will happen here that's how you are getting this particular series of logic to work